after that crash. Meanwhile, tonight, the community wants answers after someone stole something in a local park that, pe that people were using for fun. Yeah, Covington police say thieves took off with more than a dozen of the new disc golf baskets there at Davu Park. Wouldn't you know it, they put something great in like this and somebody just pulls the rug out. WLWT News 5 anchor Ashley Kirkland has the latest now on the investigation. A Ashley. lot of people want to know just why, guys. Well, disc golf has been around for decades. It picked up major steam during the pandemic, and the new baskets installed at Davu Park this weekend opened to much excitement, but the fun was short-lived. So it's, it's very similar to golf. Um, you have basically different clubs. It's hardly a new sport, but disc golf is all the rave, attracting sometimes hundreds of players to local parks. COVID hit, everybody had to get outside and do something. Um, disc golf went from here to here. What they expected to be like a five year span happened in a year. Just this past Friday, baskets were installed at Davu Park in Covington with a grand opening on Saturday. Unofficially, we had approximately 700 playthroughs in just the few days that it's been open. Today, people woke up to the news that multiple of the 18 baskets were stolen from the course. Through the night, had basically stolen 12 of the what they call the whole baskets and destroy the 13th one. Unfortunately, it's not uncommon for a basket to go taken out of a, a course, um, but usually it's one at a time. It's not you know, like a dozen baskets. Police say the thieves caused five to six thousand dollars in damage. This was not a simple act of vandalism. This was a coordinated theft. Based on the size of the baskets that someone got away with, Hazard says the thief would have had to have a big truck or trailer, the driver even leaving behind damage in the park. We saw where they had driven off off the road through the woods to get to these and had destroyed or damaged some of the trees. Yeah, it's really unfortunate. If you have any information on who may have stolen the baskets, give Covington Police a call. Now, police say this is a felony punishable of up to five years in prison. Ashley Kirkland, WLWT News 5. Ashley, thanks so much. The